for the first two months, he didn't show us uh, Bill as Pennywise or anything um, until it was actually in a take. So um, that was definitely an amazing idea because it, it got our real reactions, and it definitely got it. He is kind of the, the really smart one of the group, um, and he was, I guess you could kind of say, the nerdy one. Um, but he never had any friends at the start, um, which he didn't think that was a bad thing uh, until he met the Losers Club, then he thought it was the greatest thing in the world. The first day we met, we could have been friends for like 10 years, it looked like. It was the chemistry with everyone on and off set is absolutely amazing. This is definitely, I think, the best chemistry I've ever had with kids. Nick did want to stay away, but, you know, we love Nick. Nick, well, when, when we did break him into coming on, coming on with us, uh, he's been absolutely amazing. He's really nice. It's, it's really weird um, going to, like, totally friends, and then one second he's beating me up, and one second he's hugging me. It's, it's, really, it's really weird to just, like, keep turning off and on. Oh my gosh, he is so nice. Like, right before takes, he'll be like, so uh, Finn, you, you gotta remember that move, right? And it's like, yeah, okay, I got it. And then uh, one time when Jack was getting slobbered on, his watch was fixed and he, he, had, a, he had a broken arm, so he couldn't move that. Um, and I was like, can somebody help me with my watch? And then Bill runs over and fixes his watch and then runs back and gets in character. Hey Lisa here with some horrifying movie facts for you. Though it's never stated in the film, the demon that takes possession of Riga McCann has a name, Pazuzu, which is taken from the name of the King of the Demons in Assyrian and Babylonian mythology. Now the poster for the Ghoulies, featuring a ghoulie popping out of a toilet, reportedly caused several angry mothers to write letters to the studio saying that their kids were too scared to use the bathroom after seeing the poster. Hmm. And the original title for Texas Chainsaw Massacre was head cheese. The actor who plays Leatherface, Gunnar Hansen, had to wear three inch heels so he could tower over everyone in the cast, which made chase scenes a little more challenging to film. Keep up to date with all the latest releases by subscribing to our channel and checking the notification bell. And I'll see you next time.